Hi, Randy Bowling here from Bowling RV in Ottumwa, Iowa. Today we're going to walk you through a 39-foot Northern Star diesel pusher by Newmar. What I want to start with is pan down to the real ceramic tile on the floor. You'll notice the leather chairs, fully retractable. Uh, there is a power seat extender on the leg rest for the passenger side. The seats also recline. The driver's side is going to be a six-way power seat and it also reclines. The seats are made by Flex Steel and they're ultra leather. We do have up above here a large 27 inch Sony Triton flat screen TV and we've also got stereo speakers that have surround and processing all through the motorhome. Over on this side hooked up to the TV we have a, a digital processing system which is called a switching box. On this you can run your satellite controls VCR or a DVD player and you can control it not only up front but back in the bedroom as well just by the push of a button. There's also a power amplifier to bring in the stations that are a little further out. You have a hi-fi forehead VCR and also a five disc CD changer that are also a DVD player involved. And it's all hooked up to your 5-1 surround sound. You notice the solid wood doors with the glass insert, so you can run your remote controls right to all your all your components. Over on this side, we've got all your controls for the slide out room, your satellite dish, your battery disconnects, your outside lights, LP system, your 2000 watt Xantrex inverter, your hot water heater on electric and gas, it also has a block heater on the engine for in the winter time. And then your controls for the water pump and all your holding tanks. So all your controls are in one central location, very easy to get to. If you look up over on this side, we actually, and I'm not sure, I think we've got it covered up here by our curtain, but the controls for our power awning are there. Uh, over on this side, you'll notice that we have a six speed automatic Allison transmission with push button controls. There's also power heated mirrors, there's an exhaust brake, and then your automatic leveling jacks. Uh, nice thing about these leveling jacks is when you get to the campground, you don't even need to go outside the coach. If you don't like your neighbor, if it's raining out, if it's snowing out, you just push a button and that's going to level you up. Let's walk back in and hit the end of the living room. We're going to look first of all at our big three cushion couch with a height of bed, an actual pull out height of bed. All the windows are dual pane. They have day night shades on them, so that's your day shade. And that is your night shade. Just by the pull of a couple handles, you can release that. We've got solid cherry wood cabinets all the way throughout it. All the books and papers and manuals, owner's manuals, are with this coach and inside the cabinets. It does have a freestanding table and chairs. There is a leaf in the table to extend it, and it's all solid cherry wood, just like the rest of the coach. You come back this direction, and we have a washer and dryer stackable unit that fits right back in the closet. Now, if you didn't want the washer and dryer here, we could take it out and just make one big closet. Going into the kitchen, we've got big side-by-side -side Norcold refrigerator. And you can see the massive amount of storage in there. There is an ice maker up in the top. So you can keep those cold Pepsis and cold Cokes with ice cold ice cubes. We're gonna walk into the kitchen. We've got a counter extension in the kitchen. You'll notice that all the countertops are Corian solid surface. There's solid surface sink covers. There's also a solid surface stove cover. The faucet is a Moen faucet, as you can see by the logo. It is a pull-out faucet with a single sprayer on it. So it reminds you of just like the one you have at home, high quality stuff. There's a drinking water, water purification system in it. You can peek in the cabinets. The cabinets are all finished with nice wood. And you can see there's soft white carpet in there to set your dishes on and all your uh, pots, pans, plates. This has adjustable shelving here, so if you want to get the cereal boxes in there, the peanut butter, whatever you've got, you can adjust those shelves to whatever your needs are. Here we've got a 30-inch GE Space Maker convection microwave. And Colton's going to pan in there and show you. It's all stainless steel, has a rack in it, also has a turnstile, so you can use it as a regular microwave or a convection microwave. And that's 30 inches wide. We have three burner stove. The front burner is a high output burner. 
and then you have two regular burners in the back and you see that this this pull down solid surface cover now there's no oven in this coach but as you can see it gave us big drawers and the drawers are finished you can see the finish on the wood down on the bottom of the drawers so we've got three drawers there that give you a lot more storage space when you've got that convection microwave we really don't need that oven because this will bake brown and broil anything you need you've got lots of drawers here's all the remotes for all the mechanisms the dvd player the tv the stereo we've got all the remotes they put them right in the drawer for us there's nice storage underneath the sink there's deep storage there you can get to the hot water heater the bypass on it for winterization is accessible and easy to get to once again you've got real ceramic tile in the whole coach which is grouted it sits on a rubber pad moving forward in the coach we have a j leather sofa and this sofa does not make it to a bed but it does have storage whoops that will pull out underneath it looks like we've got some coffee grounds there Walking back into the bedroom, we've got nice storage here in the hallway. I'm going to let Colt come around and shoot the picture of that. We've got adjustable shelving there, all the way down. We've also got shelving here in the bathroom. So if, to put towels and stuff right next to your shower, it's all adjustable. So if you want to put your washcloths on one, your towels on another, you've got lots of room. You can carry your laundry detergent down on the bottom. This is our walk-in shower. If you notice, this is a one-piece shower. There's no seams. There's no seam at the bottom. The sidewall does not overlap the base. It's all one piece, a uniform piece. And it's got glass enclosure all the way around it. And there's a nice, big, fantastic fan up in the ceiling right above it to suck out all that humidity and all that steam. Your toilet is in its own private room as well. I'm going to get out of the way here and let Colton show you this. But it's got a nice vanity. It's residential height, so it doesn't sit real low. All your controls are in there. It does have another fantastic fan, and the fans do have a rain sensor on it if you shoot up there at the top. And then you can see your vanity, your lighted vanity, and all your controls are in there. It's a porcelain toilet, and it has a foot flush on it. There's also a bidet on it, so it does have a sprayer for those of you who are messy. Going into the bedroom, We've got a sink in the bedroom with another little vanity if you want to just keep your toothbrush out here or your soaps uh, shaving kit makeup you've got solid wood surface and solid wood drawers so you've got storage there and there's storage back here in the back which is deep storage and you have another flat screen sony tv there's storage above the tv there's also storage over here actually that gets into your fuse box uh, all your breakers and your fuses are back here in the bedroom. There's storage here. I don't know if Colton can pan up. There's fluorescent lighting on the ceiling and also there's a ceiling fan in the bedroom which is very nice. We've got it going right now and it's moving quite a bit of air. There is a large closet all the way in the back with shelving in it. bed also lifts up and I believe there's storage underneath this big massive bed if you can pan underneath there you can see the storage for the bedding and the pillows blankets and I'm gonna let Colton just take a couple panoramic view shots of this thing and if you guys have any questions call us at Bowling RV at 1-800-246-5497 it's 1-800-246-5497